Hi everybody, do you know how much fun contact paper can be? Okay, you probably might not have any laying around your house, but go on Amazon and look up rolls of contact paper and they have it for you. So it's about $5.99 a roll. If you keep scrolling, you'll find the right one. So it's just these long sheets and you peel the back off so that the sticky part is facing out. And how fun is that? Listen to that sound. And even sitting age babies can do pat, pat, pat on the table or pat, 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 just lay their hands on this and feel how the sticky goes. Toddlers can shake colored sand. Um, if you don't have colored sand, get the thin sprinkles. I didn't have any laying around the house, but I have some of these and it's really, really cool. Can you see the sprinkles? Now you can kind of make art with it and you can move it around. Um, if you have the fine graded stuff, you can actually write letters and designs and um, shapes and all kinds of things. But for your other um, toddlers, I you can put it on the wall because toddlers love stand up art and stand up experiences. So just go through your house. Maybe you have some different shapes of paper. You can make it stick. It's just a really great collage. If you have ribbon in your house, cut safe lengths of ribbon, depending on your child's age. I don't know, you probably have some cotton balls. I found this like in the um, family time room. Let's see if it'll stick. It's stick and fall, that's fine too. I found a bow, bows can go on there, fabric swatches, cut up old stuff. Pipe cleaners will also work really nicely. And the pipe cleaners are kind of cool because you can bend them and make 3D shapes too. So that might be fun. Last but not least, you know I am all in kinesthetic body experience. So of course I love the art and I love the shaking, but I really, really like touching with my toes. And when we used to do this in class, now again, this is way too small of a sheet. I want runway size. But what would happen is some kids would be like, or they do it with their toes in their hands and then they look at their hands like, why is my hand sticky? But it's not on their hand, it's on the paper. So it's a whole science experience too. But go ahead and you'll see children kind of going back and forth. It becomes problem solving. It becomes science investigation. It is the best all in whole body experience. So have fun and let's get sticky today.